through the Rainbow Bar and Grill. See the sign? And this is where Stephen hung out with Guns N' Roses all the time. And they ate here and they just hung out. And the people that own the place were very nice to him. So that's nice to know. I don't wish anybody to live my life. I really don't. There was a lady across the street from me and her son, listen to this one. Her son, her grandson is a drummer. And uh, she came over to my house one day and she said, I want you to come with me. My grandson is going to be in a drumathon, a drumathon at the park. And I says to her, I says, Amanda, I'm so sorry. I can't do it. And I says, uh, pray that he doesn't become a musician, you know, a big star. I said this to the grandmother. And you want to know something? He overdosed at the age, of, in his early 20s, because he wanted to be just like Stephen. He wanted to play the drums like Stephen. He wanted to be Stephen. And you want to know something? I feel so blessed that my son is still here with me. But this boy wanted to be just like Stephen, smoked heroin, shot it up, whatever he did. And she, he always said, I want to be just like Stephen. He's gone. He overdosed on drugs. So I know what goes on. It's not, it's not a wonderful life. And anytime I see somebody saying, Oh, my son does this, or my son does this in the music business. I pray for them because I know what it's all about. You know, it's not right. So, like I say, I don't wish my life on anybody. See up there? That's a sign from my for my son. It's Rainbow Rock My World. That's what Stephen Adler does. And look, there's a picture of him above there.